Is this the last update on the massive kitchen renovation? If you have not seen the episode prior to this one, you have to click the link in the description. Massive amounts of drama in the last episode. If you're unfamiliar with that dramatic video, this one might not make much sense to you. If you like cool t-shirts like this, sweatshirts, coffee mugs, link will be in the description for that as well. Today's video is sponsored by the WD-40 company. I'm going to be using the WD-40 Specialist Superior Performance True Multi-Purpose Grease. I'm going to be greasing the hinges on my tool trailer. Here we go. <clears throat> Gotta squeeze it in there good. All greased up and good for another 10 years. Okay, we are all reinstalled, and this, these cabinets are perfect, supreme. There aren't words to describe how perfect the cabinets are and how perfect the installation is. And what I mean by that is they are, I mean, laser level from here all the way over to there. Both this cabinet and this cabinet are custom cut for this being extra high like a half inch high. There's just a, an uphill swoop in this corner here. Everything from here all the way around is mostly level except there's a hump on the floor on the back side of the peninsula. Uh, I was able to shim that. When they put the countertop in the first time, uh, they didn't have to do any shimming. It was just like, whew. I'm gonna clean up my, my mess here. Gotta go to another job. Don't think I'll be recording that one either. Just got to get it done and make sure I can get back here this afternoon. I'm still waiting for a call of when they will be here. I got to level up this dishwasher too. It's leaning a little bit that way. Countertops are not coming today. What a surprise. They had to cut some section. I'm not sure what section they had to cut. Welcome back. It is 9.40 in the morning the next day. While I'm waiting, I think I'm going to install the garbage disposal. Hook up the dishwasher. Okay, the garbage disposal is in. Dishwasher is hooked up. It's 10.40. No one's here. <clears throat>
Now here's the update. Countertops in. It is not 100% cured. The epoxy seen here and here. You can see the clamps are still set up. I kicked them out. I gotta go so that I'm not late for my next appointment. I'm gonna try to be back here at 3.30 and they're gonna send another guy out to finish these seams. Um, the owner himself came out and was out here scrubbing this countertop, getting all those black marks. Um, and it's not, they're not really scratches, but uh, the seam color is 100 times better. You will not be able to see it from three feet away. That's what I was promised and that's what um, I think we're gonna get. It's done. Finally done. They just left. It's it's almost six o'clock at night. Uh, they did come back. Met them here at three thirty, and they stayed a while. You guys, you guys probably can't see that scene. It's right there. You can just barely see that seam. That the front side here, he had to work a few times, but. Right about here it disappears. We got rid of that, that spliced section over there. They cleaned and polished every, all, every one of those 25 black marks that I called them out on. Uh, water works amazing, hot and cold. Christmas is coming up soon, so hopefully I'll get the drawers all built and installed before Christmas. I think I will. Um, I'll probably do a, a video on like one drawer especially the drawer glides that have to be mounted a specific way. I think it's like $1,400 in just the drawer slides, guides, whatever you want to call them. So thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, hit the bell. Goodbye.